that can move two times and a half to the left and two times and a half to the right because of that circular rail we have over there. Now, as you all saw, the uh, Gregorian Dome was moving right now, right? It's thanks to an, uh, another rail that we have on the Azimuth Arm. So not only the Gregorian Dome can move, we also can move the um, 430 antenna, which is this antenna you see looking down, pointing down. That antenna is 100 feet long, and we call it the 430 antenna because it works under a frequency of 430 megahertz. Um, that antenna is used strictly when we are doing exper um, experiments of uh, observations of the ionosphere. So whenever we're doing um, studies of the atmosphere, we're going to be using that 430 antenna. Now, we're going to go is 75 tons, it weighs 75 tons, it has 12 antennas inside of it and two receptors. Um, it works under a frequency of 50,000 up to uh, 10,000 up to 50,000 megahertz. And we use it strictly for astronomical investigation. Uh, so whenever we're looking at a planet, comet, uh, um, astronaut, <laughs> I was gonna say astronaut. Planet, comet, um, excuse me. That's what I was trying to say. Whenever we're looking at um, one of those things, we're going to be using the Gregorian drone to emit the radio waves, right? Now, 450 feet below the platform, you're going to see the The moon has a diameter of 305 meters. The one in China has a diameter of 500 meters. All right? So, um, our main uh, reflector is made out of 38,778 perforated aluminum panels. You can see one of the panels.